Hello everyone, and welcome! We are back with some more Final Fantasy... Mm. <clears throat> Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Uh... Oh, wait. That's what I should have said. There we go. Oh, that already went out, but whatever. But yeah, we uh, woke up the other day as Zack. And I've really wanted to play, so earlier today I just kind of came over and booted up and was looking around and had really no idea that, uh, these guys are here. Like, Aerith and Cloud are just upstairs. This has to have been after... Like, looking at it, it is after Cloud has gotten the Soldier Serum. Well, not Soldier Serum, but... The, not S, uh, well, I, I think it's S, or the J, the G. It's, it's either the Genova or the Sephiroth cells that turns him technically into a soldier. Because he has the soldier uniform versus his uh, normal military Shinra uniform. And Aerith is here, which I don't recall that Zack and Aerith ever re-met after the events of... Zack's life, because I believed he died in a war ba in a battle. Oh, hello. Wait. Um, Cloud's Elmira? Cloud's mother. Zach, hello. Hi. Yeah. This is quite interesting. Where is she? Upstairs. Oh wait. No, that's not Cloud's. Elmira is Aerith's mother. Okay, so they were going to show us that this was going on. But, yeah, situationally, I don't understand, unless this is some kind of dream from Zack's perspective. I'm going to take her home. Now slow down. I've been to your place. Shinra's got it staked out. Not anymore. They have bigger things to worry about. Oh, dear. But... And I can't leave her with you. Of course you can. Just look at Cloud. I've been taking care of... No, you haven't. Look at the state you've left her in. You didn't even wipe her face, for goodness sake. That so, does tend to happen, but also, hey, Silver. You, you may you want to, at the very least, to go lay down for a bit. I can see that I was right to be concerned. It's all dependent on how things go. I'm also very confused because this is part of the story that has never really been talked about. I brought a wheelchair for Aerith. <laughs> but if Cloud's coming too, you'll just have to carry him. Think you can handle that? I, I'm sure Zack can carry Cloud. Yeah, I can do that much. That's Aerith's, uh... Flips table. Yes. It'll be f I know. You'll be fine, I'm sure. Just, you know, get rested and relaxing. I need to get rid of that link. Huh? Aerith! She okay? You're okay. Right, Aerith? I thought, I'm confused, because I thought Oates was, would be younger right now. There's never any, like, guarantee of anything in Final Fantasy. Hey, Elmira. Yes? What happened to this place? The world's ending. At least, that's what everyone's saying. Interesting. Okay, that just feels very Elden Ring. In a very strange dream. I'm guessing that this might be a dream from Cloud's perspective as well, by the way. Because, yeah, we're out here. Okay, that's the path? I, I don't understand. <laughs> I actually expected to be able to play as Zack for more than that, but 
All good. Hey, which way do you think Midgar is? It would be east of here. That way. Hmm. I wonder how my mom's doing back there. She seemed fine when I saw her. Maybe a little worried. She's gonna hate me for this. <laughs> Talk to her as soon as you get home. She'll understand. Really looking forward to that conversation. Oh, oh geez. <laughs> I, uh... I was pretty heavily damaged in that last fight, huh? That is... Fifth... It... I'm honestly curious if tomatoes would technically have 50 seeds? To them, but that doesn't make the most sense either. But also, just puking up hundreds of seeds because I guess in your dreams you ate a bunch of tomatoes. That sounds like chaos dreaming. Oh, hey y'all. We have found the rest of the team. Sorry, we're late. You okay? Yep. Really worked up a sweat. So how'd recon go? All clear. I mean, that's no fair. Prizes and no materia. <laughs> we managed to catch her before she could get as far as the reactor. <coughs> Which is the whole reason we're here. Because so like, up, or those hooded I think per slice you could get upwards of ten materia, or not materia. Uh. Tomato seeds per tomato, just because of how they are kind of designed. We have zinc. I'm pressing the wrong button to run. That's it. The Corel reactor. It went boom. I also heard a well. I knew it was coming, but I don't know when now. The Final Fantasy 16 DLC should be coming out not Wait, that so far from now. All these creepy hooded guys anyway. They're Shinra's victims. Hmm. Well, they're in good company. I'll give them that. Hmm? How you figure? When Shinra invaded Wutai, it was... Oh, wow. Bad. They looked yeah. towns, killed thousands. And when the dust settled, they forced some BS truce on us. I thought both sides wanted a ceasefire. <laughs> the old geezers at the top did, yeah. But the rest of us were pissed. They've been running Wutai into the ground for years. It was the last straw. We were done. Everyone was ready to kick those old farts to the curb, and that's when Colonel Lodbrock's team showed up. I am. Lodbrock. We, I learned about him last time. Join the cause. <laughs> you say? Lodbrock. This <coughs> from the Fair. Paved the way forward. At the very least, you're not dealing with yeah, what I deal with sometimes, yeah, which are dreams that are absolute chaos to the extent no, that I can't revolution. sleep. Like I'm, like I'm almost sleep paralysis, sleep paralyzed, but it's all a bunch of thought process but going on in here. Because once this war with Shinra's behind us, the whole country's gonna come together and decide what kind of government we want. Okay. Which is why we're doing everything we can to make sure the interim ends in independence. Pretty cool, right? <laughs> That does sound nice. Just gonna stand there? Let's get going. <laughs> All 
robed man, gaha. Hard time breathing. Yeah, I expected more to be done with the story where Zack was. That's interesting. Like, it makes you curious, but again, you don't get to do much. I do not want to follow Yuffie. It is a big pool of Mako. So, like, all that stuff down there is Mako? Mako, sorry. Then it's gotta be hiding some ginormous materia! Do not. Oh, I'm gonna be so powerful, it's scary. Oh no. Some kind of fiend is on its way up. Oh, wait, that is an Ultima weapon, isn't it? Or that's a weapon. That's not. That's not safe. Also, that's how they introduce the weapons to us. That's kind of cool. The hell was that thing? Tutelary creatures, set only to appear when the planet is in grave danger. Hojo has sought them for years. Did you see that was <laughs> Yes, a sprite demon. That had to have been the biggest freaking materia ever! Just gotta figure out how to catch that overgrown fish. That guardian of the planet? Whatever. I'm not about to let a materia that beautiful get away. And just so we're clear, it's mine. I call it. Sure, Yuffie. Cool. You fish. Huh? Yay, <laughs> no fishing mini games. Hey, not cool. This isn't goodbye, sweet weapon. I'll be back for you soon. We will I definitely, if we get the chance to, will find and collect the materia off of the, the weapons. Like that. Wouldn't show up unless Jinra had really pushed the planet to the edge. Meaning, Avalanche was right about the threat they posed all along. We were. Oh, we? Barrett's rationalizing for himself. Yeah. But don't forget, Shinra is not the only problem. Oh. Right. Sephiroth is still out there. He is, and talking won't stop him. True. Oh, now we follow Barrett. Okay, Yuffie is. I'm not really gonna adjust my team at the moment, probably primarily because we're more than likely going to end up with other people in the team. Like, it, they'll separate us at some point. That is also some very light metal if we can just kick it over like that. I do need to use Aerith's ability. I'm always confused why... Oh, well, there's one over here, but I... Yeah. The elevator buttons are always in the back corner. Tight space. Wait. Okay, I was about to say, did we leave Yuffie behind? Sure. Mushroom. Yeah, I forgot we were just trying to get to the other side of the mountain, huh? Floating around me. I mean, 
to be fair, his weapon is not light. It's just weird. Well, I mean, okay, barrel is fine. It's just, it looked like there was a cross beam that I just walked over. Hmm. We should explore. Because there's. Oh. Well, I was gonna explore, but they wanted me to go this way. I get. Hello. <laughs> Name a Pokemon. For now. Sure, Silver. Name whatever Pokemon you want. This sucks. Do you know any Pokemon? Um. You I can't. Area, don't you? So, you did used to have the ability to, in the original, rename your party members. You can't in this one. <laughs> Two rooms up there, at the top of the cliff. How do we reach it? We cl through the mine. Ah. There'll be a walk in the park, though. Place has been abandoned for years. Fair. <gasps> uh, they're just. <laughs> I mean, that's. We're working on it. Just wait a minute. I mean, that's their plan. Oh no. Hey. Cloud. <laughs> rename. You renamed the cool dog to cool dog. I mean, his name's Red Thirteen. I think he actually does have a proper Perhaps name. The Mako got to him. Regardless, he's clearly tired. Cloud could rest here while a couple of us go and lower the bridge. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. Works we're gonna me. have a point in time that without rings, Cloud. You know we're done. And you don't move till you're good and ready. All right, put on your mining helmets and follow me. Okay, cool. Yuffie. Neat. But additionally, we're gonna buy discounted items. And look at everything else we have access to. As well, this, because I think we, uh... Aerith... Oh, do you have anything to do? I need you to get a higher weapon level and that's really it. Yeah, we're fine for now. So what I've been doing is only trying to only utilize uh, orange and pink so we get abilities rather than stat upgrades, just so it's a bit more fun. Additionally, I was kind of hoping there might be more around here to do. Like, on the ground level. Aha! Not an item, or it's an item chest, not a weapon chest, but all good. Again, we are due for some weapons if the story falls right. Hmm. Yeah. I could have just walked up to that one. Pigeons. That's mean, we can't attack the pigeons. a thing. Fortress Bracer. And Enhanced Fortress Bracer. Some things are coming off the list. <laughs> That's good. Granted, soon we will get more items on the list.
Wait. We have a, oh, I need the ancient bark. I really am hoping that like the Ultima weapon is tied to getting all of those done. Sure. But we're not to that part yet. That and because this is not a one-to-one -one remake. Which way? Uh, with that thing. But we're gonna have to power it on first. Alright. So there is a chance that it's completely different in this version of the story. Fun. L2 to hook. Okay, so we're getting more interesting uh, mechanics to play around, around with. Also, this is a weapon chest. Ooh, Twin Viper. Uh, equipment, Yuffie... Twin Viper. That's not great. But I would like to get Windstorm. So I guess we'll just stick with this until we can put the four point shuriken back on. Like, I would say the best thing to think about when it comes to the naming uh, conventions is that they are quite literally just in basic order when you consider numbers. And then anything with a colon and a secondary word is just an addition to the story of the numbered games. Like, uh, also, there's also there are things like thirteen and thirteen two. Oh, yeah, it's these. I remember that. I believe you only go up so high. Windstorm. Ta-da! Bucket. about me oh we mastered the ability cool so now I can go back to the four point shuriken just so I have the extra materia oh yeah like it's not a bad naming convention at all it's just that all of the games that are numbered have no correlation directly. Also, we get to play as the spray, the little ninja girl ta today. Which, it's been rare so far to uh, get to play as anything but Cloud. Materials. 
As it is, we just look around as much as we can. That direction looks... Oh yeah, that direction is the right direction, because... Box of stuff. Oh, hi, Ether. Cool. I like that her, uh... Shuriken acts as a boomerang. Technically. Because it grabs and brings stuff back to us. Oh. They left the party because it is a solo adventure. That goes... Ah. I honestly expected to be able to go that way. We can get over there. I know. Like, video game boomerang is more the speed. Okay. I just get to do ninjutsu. I will say Yuffie is one of the better options for certain aspects. Like, in her DLC in the first game, she felt really strong. Yeah, Captain America's shield physics. Because she had an she had elemental affinity for everything. Because of the ninjutsu skill. Leveled. Also, she does have to go and retrieve her, uh. whatever it's called, at some points in the store. Uh, like, if I throw it and it's stuck in a creature, it has to come. I have to go get it again. Is what I should say. Additionally, she's got some fun, uh. weapon hit and obstacle. Oh no. I kind of can see where I need to go, but... Uh. Okay, that gets us across there. So this is probably just hidden stuff. They do tend to put weapons around in places. We've got an ad in a minute. There we go. Bucket. Ooh. Box of stuff. Yeah, that's nice. I don't know why they put one item in crates, but whatever. That's... that's honestly super useful to get. I'm glad I made sure to look for it. Because we probably can't get back there now. As we go for... oh, hey! The zipline, that leads us here. 
venison. Hmm. Exquisite beast hide is nice. I do need to get back to playing with Aerith, just because I need to max out her one of her abilities. So she can learn it permanently and we can pick weapon based off of that. I did think Yes, I know. It's another flashy Final Fantasy game, Silver. Everything's just bright and colorful. Oh, hello, Mushroom. I 